lace pork elm trees. Beautiful elm pork trees in front of my home. My ex-wife, hi, I'm William Overlander. My ex-wife told me, get rid of those damn trees. They're in front of your house, chop them down. And lots of people do. But the name of the street across from me that way is called Elm, which is named after a special tree called a lace pork elm. Now, let's look at how beautiful this is. I understand it's by my front door. I have my chair there. And here's my American flags. And this is for William's favorite videos. I try and save all the lace parks I can. You know, people chop these things down. And this is horrible. Now, this is this here is a cherry tree. and uh, But over here is more lace parks. And stuff that I saved from other people were trying to kill these plants. And uh, let's just go around another lace park. And the uh, point is, there used to be a giant, giant, beautiful lace park. And all it had was a little bit of problems. Here's another lace park. This is Lace Park Elm. And this hides my house. My, my mom enjoyed the beauty of what? My mom enjoyed the beauty of privacy. You know, this is my private property. Now here, over here, let's see. This is a Lace Park that's right on the property line, belongs to my neighbor. Now when this house behind me was sold, was a beautiful row of lace park elms that was chopped down when the house was sold and that was over the fence and it gave me my privacy i used to sit on my park bench have some cold iced tea but when they chopped all the tree down there was no reason there was no reason to sit out there in the hot sun all my beautiful trees are gone and i used to pour um, buckets of water over the fence to keep those trees alive. Now the miracle of God is what? The miracle of God is now I have my own lace parks on my own land. And that son of a gun next door or the next person can't chop them down or I hope they don't chop them down. We realize the beauty of what? The lace park elm. Beautiful, beautiful trees that grow only, well, Maybe they grow somewhere else, but they grow here in Oklahoma. And uh, I've seen these things. I've taken care of these things for many, many years. The beauty, the beauty of the Lace Park Elm. Wow. Huh? It's like a forest. It's a hedge of protection. Oh, Lord, thank you so much for taking care of my trees. Enjoy William's favorite videos, and boy, this was a really long one. Have a blessed day. And this is the story of what? The beautiful Lace Park Elm. Look at the leaves. It's like here in Oklahoma. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. One after the other, after the other. Why? Because I wouldn't kill him. My neighbor did. I'm William Oberlander. And I don't believe in unnecessary killing of plants for no reasons. Have a blessed day.